far as I can recall, interested in medicine from the time I was really young. I can't remember a time I hadn't considered that. I always had fairly good aptitude in science. I liked people, cared about people, and I just kind of gravitated to the field. I had a hard time really um, picking a one field. Uh, it seemed like every field we would have rotations on I enjoyed. So it made me feel that I wanted to be more of a generalist like a family practitioner. And really all my my own personal role models and the doctors that I knew growing, growing up uh, were all family doctors. I fortunately was healthy enough I didn't need any specialists. So I didn't really have a, a strong orientation in that direction. What really sometimes amazes me is sometimes the effects that you have on a patient over relatively small things. People will come in and say, you saved my life. And I'll say, saving your life is doing CPR in the emergency room or something like that. They'll say, well, three years ago, you told me that if I didn't do this or do this, this was going to happen, or you picked up this diagnosis. They're coming and saying, because of you, this was found. And you don't always realize it. Sometimes you think it's fairly routine, and, and, and then someone comes in and hits you with that, and it just kind of amazes you. I've been caring for some of my patients now for over 30 years, and we've become close friends. Just sitting and talking, and half of our visit often is just kind of BSing about things before we even get into the medicine. In fact, I had a patient today who, uh, he was my first patient I saw out here, which I don't remember, but he said when I called for my appointment, they asked, what are you seeing him for? And he said, to BS for a while. Uh, he said, I just wanted to come talk to you. So that's what I enjoy the most.